Ever wondered who gives life to your favorite animated characters? Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the world of voice acting and exploring some of the most iconic voices behind your favorite animated characters. Let's get started. Number one, we have Miles Morales, the new Spider-Man in Into the Spider-Verse. He's voiced by Shamik Moore. His youthful and energetic voice perfectly captures Miles's journey from an ordinary teenager to an extraordinary superhero. Moore brings a unique authenticity to the role, making Miles relatable and inspiring for audiences of all ages. Okay, let's do this one last time, yeah? For real this time, this is it. My name is Miles Morales. I was bitten by a radioactive spider, and for like two days, I've been the one and only Spider-Man. Number two, we have Katie Mitchell from The Mitchells vs. The Machines, voiced by Abby Jacobson. Katie's quirky and passionate personality shines through. Jacobson's performance perfectly portrays Katie's creative spirit and adventurous nature, making her a standout character in this animated adventure. Hang on, guys. Better watch out, pal. Because I've broken six bones in my life accidentally, but I'm gonna break you on purpose. Number three, Emily, the enchanting corpse bride from Tim Burton's Corpse Bride, is voiced by Helena Bonham Carter. Her hauntingly beautiful voice adds a touch of elegance and melancholy to the character, perfectly capturing Emily's tragic and romantic storyline. Carter's voice brings depth and emotion to the role, making Emily an unforgettable character. Hello? Is anyone home? Hello? I spent so long in the darkness. I'd almost forgotten how beautiful the moonlight is. Number 4. Master Shifu, the wise and skilled kung fu teacher in Kung Fu Panda, is voiced by Dustin Hoffman. His commanding and authoritative voice adds depth to Shifu's wisdom and strength, making him a mentor worth admiring. Hoffman's performance brings both humor and gravitas to the character making Shifu a beloved figure in the franchise. It seems you have found inner peace at such a young age. Number 5. DJ, the brave protagonist of Monster House, is voiced by Mitchell Musso. His youthful and adventurous voice perfectly captures DJ's determination and bravery as he faces the horrors of the haunted house. Musso's performance brings a sense of realism to DJ's character, making his journey both thrilling and relatable. Chowder, your ball just landed on Nebercracker's lawn. It doesn't exist anymore. Number six, Carl Fredrickson, the grumpy yet lovable old man from Pixar's Up, is voiced by Edward Asner. His rich and emotional voice adds layers to Carl's heartwarming journey, from his initial grumpiness to his eventual softening. Asner's performance is both touching and humorous, making Carl an endearing character. You ever heard of a snipe? Snipe? Bird, beady eyes. Every night it sneaks in my yard and gobbles my poor azaleas. I'm elderly and infirm. I can't catch it. If only someone could help me. Number seven, Hiccup, the courageous dragon rider from How to Train Your Dragon, is voiced by Jay Barrickle. His unique and relatable voice captures Hiccup's growth from a young Viking to a leader of his people. Barichel's performance brings a blend of vulnerability and bravery to Hiccup, making his character arc incredibly compelling. Yeah, between you and me, the village could do with a little less feeding, don't you think? The simplest orders. I, I can't stop myself. I see a dragon and I have to just kill it, you know? It's who I am, Dad. Number 8. Mike Wazowski, the hilarious and hardworking monster from Monsters, Inc., is voiced by Billy Crystal. His comedic and energetic voice makes Mike one of the most memorable and beloved characters in the Pixar universe. Crystal's performance brings endless humor and charm to the character, making Mike an iconic figure. Well, everyone, I don't mean to get emotional, but everything in my life has led to this moment. Let it not be just the beginning of my dream, but the beginning of all of our dreams. Number 9. Coraline, the brave and curious girl from the movie Coraline, is voiced by Dakota Fanning. Her expressive and engaging voice perfectly captures Coraline's adventurous spirit as she navigates the mysterious and dangerous world. Fanning's performance adds depth and authenticity to the character, making Coraline's journey even more captivating. Um, I want stuff growing when my friends come to visit. Isn't that why we moved here? 
Coraline. Coraline Jones. Hmm. Definitely hurt someone. Why were you born? Number 10. Buzz Lightyear, the fearless space ranger from Toy Story, is voiced by Tim Allen. His heroic and confident voice adds a touch of epic adventure to Buzz's character, making him one of the most iconic figures in animation. Allen's performance brings a mix of humor and bravery to Buzz, making him an unforgettable character. Buzz Lightyear to Star Command. Come in, Star Command. Star Command, come in. Do you read me? Why don't they answer? <gasps> My ship! Number 11. Jessica Rabbit, the sultry and glamorous character from Who Framed Roger Rabbit, is voiced by Kathleen Turner. Her smooth and seductive voice brings Jessica's allure and mystery to the screen, making her one of the most iconic animated characters of all time. Oh no, where's Roger? Roger? He chickened out on me back at the studio. No, he didn't. I hit him on the head with a frying pan and put him in the trunk so he wouldn't get hurt. Number 12. We have Puss in Boots, the charming and swashbuckling feline from the Shrek series. Voiced by Antonio Banderas, Puss in Boots instantly became a fan favorite character. Banderas's suave and spirited voice captures Puss's adventurous personality perfectly. His performance adds a layer of wit and charisma to the character, making Puss both formidable and lovable. Doctor. Please. Relax! I am Pussy Boots! I laugh at death! <laughs> you see? And anyway, I am a cat. I have nine lives. Number 13. We have Tetsuo Shima, the troubled and powerful character from Akira. Voiced by Nozomu Sasaki in the original Japanese version, Tetsuo's intense and emotional journey is brought to life through Sasaki's remarkable performance. His voice captures Tetsuo's struggles and transformation, making the character's complex journey incredibly impactful. <laughs> Number 14. Mirabelle, the spirited and resilient protagonist of Disney's Encanto, is voiced by Stephanie Beatriz. Known for her role as Rosa Diaz in Brooklyn Nine-Nine, Beatriz brings a warm and expressive quality to Mirabelle. Her performance beautifully conveys Mirabelle's determination and heart, making her a relatable and inspiring character for audiences of all ages. Big heart, Stop. cool glasses. Mama, I te amo, cosa linda. I know what I saw. I have no idea. But there is one person. Number 15, Maui the larger-than-life demigod from Disney's Moana, is voiced by Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Johnson's charismatic and powerful voice brings Maui's bold personality to life. His performance, combined with his musical talents, makes Maui an unforgettable character. The song, You're Welcome, performed by Johnson, has become a fan favorite, showcasing his versatility as both an actor and a singer. I killed a meal, I buried its guts Sprouted a tree, now you got coconuts What's the lesson? What does it take away? Don't mess with Maui when he's on a breakaway Number 16 We have the iconic Mickey Mouse Originally voiced by Walt Disney himself Mickey's cheerful and high-pitched voice Has brought joy to audiences for decades Disney's performance perfectly captures Mickey's optimistic and adventurous spirit Making him a beloved character worldwide This is not Santa's workshop it's just one section of a creative world where new attractions for Disneyland are conceived. Number 17. We have Remy, the talented rat chef from Ratatouille, voiced by Patton Oswalt. Oswalt's enthusiastic and expressive voice brings Remy's culinary dreams to life. His performance captures Remy's passion for cooking and determination to prove himself, making him a beloved character in the Pixar universe. No! 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 Don't just hork it down! Number 18. Lumiri, the charming and hospitable candelabra from Beauty and the Beast, is voiced by Jerry Orbach. Known for his role as Detective Lenny Briscoe in Law & Order, Orbach brings a charismatic and theatrical quality to Lumiri. His performance captures Lumiri's flamboyant personality and adds a touch of elegance and humor to the character. Ah, yes. When she comes in, give her a dashing, debonair smile. Come, come, show me the smile. Number 19. Homer J. Simpson, the bumbling yet lovable father from The Simpsons, is voiced by Dan Costellanetta. 
Castellaneta's distinct and humorous voice has made Homer an iconic character in television history. His performance brings laughter to countless fans worldwide, capturing Homer's simple-mindedness and big heart. Here are your messages. You have 30 minutes to move your car. You have 10 minutes. Your car has been impounded. Your car has been crushed into a cube. You have 30 minutes to move your cube. Number 20. Donkey. The hilarious and talkative sidekick from Shrek is voiced by Eddie Murphy. Murphy's energetic and comedic voice brings a unique charm to Donkey. His performance adds a layer of humor and heart to the character, making Donkey one of the funniest and most endearing characters in the Shrek series. Cause I'm all alone, there's no one here beside me. These talented voice artists bring animated characters to life, making them unforgettable for audiences of all ages. Which character is your favorite? Comment below and let us know.